my name is Grace. Today I will read the Bible story. Oh, I finished it. Sorry. I have to go in wonderful, wonderful story. I think this is not working. Wait, I will do wonderful story. Uh, it was like this. Oh, uh, this is so not good. I will go for. No, what should I do? very tired to do this I read this oh oh there was it um oh. yes today I will read the wonderful story uh, the title is God made many things. In the beginning, there was nothing. There was no sun. There was no moon. There was no stars. I will make the world, God said. So God made the world. I will make a sun, God said. God made the sun. The sun helped you see things in the daytime. I will make a moon, God said. God made the moon. The moon helped you see things at night. I will make the stars, God said. What do you think? He did then. God made stars. Do you think, do you like stars? Yes, I like. God made a man and woman. God made you and me. God made many more things to he made them for you and me are you happy that god made everything thank you god for everything the most small oh sorry the I will read one more story the title is something tempted of Adam and Eve something bad something sad Adam and Eve has bad Band Eve was Adam's wife. They had a good home. They could do anything they wanted to do. They had many good things and they were happy. Oh, the monkey is so... There's a rabbit, and there's a lion, bird, 
veggies, flowers, trees. I can see everything. But there was one thing where they could not do. You must not eat the fruit on that tree, God said. Oh, there's a snake. From that time, Adam and Eve did not eat the fruit from the tree. Satan told to Eve one day, <coughs> It looked this delicious. Try it. It make you clever, he said. Eve knew that God did not wanted her to eat it, but she did obey God's word and ate the fruit. Adam ate it too. Then Adam and Eve knew they that they had done something very bad. They were very sad. God made them go away from their home. He took away their good food. It began to hurt them. We didn't obey God's word, they said. It is good for us to listen to God too. Okay, I will read that one more story. Noah made a big boat. Make a big boat, God said. Yes, said Noah. I will... Noah loved God. Noah obeyed God. He wanted to go what God said. God told Noah how to make a boat. God made it as God said. It took a long, long time. Noah put all kind of animal on the boat. Then Noah went into the boat. His family went with him. One animal is female and one animal is male. Okay. One day it started to rain. It rained and rained in. And rained it. The water went over the house. It went over the trees. The water went higher and higher and higher. So the there were no more people, but Noah and his family were safe in the boat. Noah obeyed God, so God took care of Noah. Thank you, God, Noah said one day. Noah thanked God for thanking care of him. 
He thanked God. He thanked God for taking care of his family. He thanked God for taking care of the animals. Thank you, God, for taking care of me. I will <laughs> read the over. Noah worked God a time to say thank you. There was water all over the world, but Noah and his family were safe. God told Noah to make a big boat. He told Noah to take his family on the big boat. He told Noah to take all the animals too. God was thoroughly taking care of them all. They were in the boat of many days. God the one day God Noah looked it out. The water was all gone. God had dented it away. We must thank God for helping us, Noah said. Noah and his family thanked God. God was pleased with them. God showed them a rainbow. You will see the rainbow many times, God said. It is a promise that it, I will not destroy the world with water. Noah was happy with God's promise. Well, the rainbow is beautiful, right? Is it? God made Noah's family and the animal happy. Yes, I told you uh, three stories. It was fun. Then bye.